this Atomic Core, we, we took a little bit of things we've done in the past, and we've had some great successes with making low RG, high differential, asymmetrical parts. And so over the course of those years, we've learned what makes them spin up faster, what makes them create the most amount of shape in the mid lane. And we learned from those processes that we can do many different things. And what we did in this one is we created a very strong center mass from the x-axis. If you look, we create down that center point from the x-axis off the pin, we create a very heavy mass. So that makes us a low RG, so it gets us to spin up faster. And then the other thing we've used over the years, we've used ellipses in a couple different cores. And what we did, we used the ellipses at these 45 degree angles. And those, what they do is they create like a helical arc effect. And so uh, when you let go of the ball and it travels down the lane, it's trying to ride itself in spin, it spins kind of like a corkscrew and it, what we call a helical arc. And as it's doing this, you have one opposing force coming to the top and the other opposing force going to the bottom. So it creates a torque effect, okay? And then a very large oval bolt in the center. And some people might say it's cosmetic, but many times, no, it's not. It actually, there's a very vital part of that. And that very large ellipses across the middle creates a very distinct preferred spin axis in that Y. And so now when we tilt that mass back and forth and we're moving it left to right, closer to or farther away from the vertical axis line, we can really control the shape. So by doing those and using those pieces and parts, many of those that have a little bit have been used in the past to help create certain designs, we've created something that's one of the strongest asymmetrical pieces uh, in the marketplace. And then the added slug to the bottom once again enhances that torque effect. So when you create that helical arc as it travels down the lane, you got the slug enhanced in that as well too as the slug comes up to the top, it creates that torque effect as well too. So lots of technology going into this atomic core to create what we feel is one of the most diverse, strongest asymmetrical balls to date.